Okay, so once you've got that, you also need to add in a command button. And we're going to name that CMD login. And you'll also see down here is a caption, that's what appears on the button. So we're just going to change that to login. You see that's updated on the screen there. Um, we want to create another form as well for people to register. So we're going to do exactly the same thing and insert another user form. Pretty much the same. This one is going to be FRM register. And we're going to add in a couple of labels, exactly the same. And you can play around and make these look better when you've got time. Um, so my name, I'm going to do LBL. Username, and I can edit the caption here if I want. And again, LBL, password, and update the caption. And for my text boxes, TXT, username. txt password okay so we've got both of our forms uh, created now and I'm just going to exit out of these and go back to my spreadsheet so what I want to do now is rename my sheet so I'm going to rename the first one home it's going to be my home page I'm going to rename the next um, section my input screen and then this is the sheet which is going to hold all the details of uh, the username and passwords of my users. So I'm going to rename this one users. The next thing I'm going to do then is uh, I'm going to create username and password fields here. And I'm also going to put another username when I'll explain why I need to do that in a second. First thing I'm going to do is if I highlight these and um, up here currently it says A1. Now I can define um, this as a name, so I'm going to call this users. So instead of getting the cell reference like I've got A1, when I actually highlight that full section there, it's going to come up for users. Or if I search for users, you'll see that it highlights that section. I'm going to do the same thing for this one and call this one passwords. So if I search for passwords now, 